Lorenzo here with Jackie D at Jackie D No Channel and today we're gonna be doing the unboxing of a cleaning device that we find online um, with the purpose of helping me out with the adaptation of a new norm and this pandemic hopefully we can go back to normal in the near future but in the meantime we have to find a way to wait our life easier hope you like it don't go away and please if you haven't subscribed this is the moment to do it and make sure you click the notification button so you don't miss any of our videos and we will greatly appreciate it with the bottom of our heart thank you for continue watching us don't go away see you in a bit one more time here you know one of our videos as you know um, we all going through a pandemic and our life has changed right and in life you learn and adapt or you die right that's a phrase that my father used to teach me learn adapt or die that's how we do I know it's a hard thing um, for us you know going through all the struggles but we have to um, get used to it and understand that for the moment, until right, we get a vaccine, hopefully soon somebody come with a very productive and efficient and trustable vaccine where our life can go back to what it used to be. But at the moment, we all have to adapt, right? So for me, it's pretty much the same. Um, I'm not saying that all the guys are like me, but I'm a very busy guy. I, have many things to do and it's hard for me to keep my places clean right and you know before the pandemic this lockdown ccq mcq this is all aeq whatever cues you want to mention out there before that um i used to have a clean lady she would come clean amazing beautiful person i'm so glad all the help she gave me and she would come here clean and my apartment always be maintain spotless unfortunately as the pandemic starts and all these lockdowns start happening it is it, you know we all have to do our part and i know it's unsafe to make it come all the way down here or me all way going all the way down there you know to create interaction for different people so we try to keep ourselves as isolated as possible to protect our health not ours but those who we care too right by also the answer a little bit, you know what I mean? So, having said that, my life haven't been that easy after that. Because, you know, I have to learn how to clean again, how to learn how to maintain things and keep everything in order and spotless. And yes, I brought broom, I brought vacuums, I brought mop, and as I much as I try for me, it's just a little harder and complicated so I'm trying to minimize my life and make it easier and more simple so in order to help myself to keep my place clean and spotless in an easier ways and faster and more efficient I decided to try a device that I saw online it's called Derma 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 spray and mop um, this Derma spray and mop actually they have, they have two versions one is only the mop one include like this one with the sweeper means i can broom sweep the dots first and then i can mop and then what i like from this one from the um ordinary sweep and mop is when you sweep you sweep with a dust pan right and then you have to like you know like that job that you continue walking trying to get all the dust and you end up half of the block before you get in on the dust that's one of the complications to have and the mop you have to, you know, mop, rinse, you know, squish, mop, rinse, squish, and you know, for me, it's too annoying. So this one is look, it meant to make my life easier, more um, easier to live, as I can sweep, press a button to throw the dust, and then for sweeping, the device have their own water tank where you can put the water and the soap. And you don't have to get the bucket around, you just have to keep swiping, spraying, swiping, and spraying. It should do our life easier. So we're gonna look into it first, right? And then we're gonna look into it first. And then after that, we're gonna give it a test and see if it's actually clean. For what I see, this look like the mop. We're gonna put it right here. Um, 
I'm gonna finish it up. This is part of the. Uh, yeah, this is part of the mod. I'm gonna learn how to deal with this in a few. Let me open this. So I have it ready for. Have it ready for the thing. Let me see. Oh, this is the one. I, so you see this? You see, this is where you put the mod, right? This is gonna be our second. And this is the sweeper. You see? This is how you sweep as you go. And this is sweep. And then you connect this piece, this, this piece here. And this is where you connect the mop, I guess, like this. And then, yes, like that, and then clean up. So I'm gonna divide it both. Uh, my understanding this is just to clean the brushes of the sweeper when it's already in use and, and dirty. Okay. I guess this is the second handle. Okay. This is the second handle. Aha, uh -huh. this is the water bottle. I think it's like 250, 300. 50 millimeters of water, so it's not a, it's a decent amount. Um, one tip, proper installation, pull out the water tank. Two. Okay. Let's see what else is in here. Foam. Foam, more foam, more foam. And that's pretty much it. This is gonna help me out to install it. I haven't installed it. I wanna do it with you guys. But what it says is that we take these two pieces first and connect them some way how. So we have to connect this somewhere uh -huh, here. We have to connect it to here, I guess you press down this. There you go. Make it stronger. Right? Oh! Sorry guys! It has some water on it! Oh! No, I did it wrong? No? Let me see. Oh yeah, 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 you have to go forward. Sorry guys, I don't do these things, so... That, I'm guessing... Uh, we put this too. So this is for the sweeper. Yes, this is for the sweeper. Guys, I'm learning, I'm learning. So I'm trying to... Oh! This is the... Okay, I was doing it wrong, I was doing it wrong. There you go! Now, this is for the sweeper. And this is where you're gonna put it for the mop. Okay, so far we got that, right? So two things they're gonna do. One thing is fill it up this with water. We're gonna give it a practice. Right? So one thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill, I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna get water in the cleaning floor and we're gonna test it in a few seconds, okay? Just bear with me. See you in a bit. So we're back guys, I just wanna have some floor detergent and some water to just to finalize the whole ensemble to my understanding. Um, this is the next step. We're going to put water here. Can I put this a little bit of water first? Because I want to see how much I like, you know, a little bit of detergent. That there, the show I'm gonna finalize it. Okay. So let's see. Very strong. I guess this is the way it is. Connect it. How do you take that back? Let me see. If I put it back, it come back. 
Yeah, it will come back. Yeah, yeah. So, we'll put it there. I'm just gonna do a practice. Let's see. Yeah, it's working. Sorry. Sorry, it's working. So, first we're gonna sweep. We're gonna use the sweep option. Um, and then we're gonna sweep the sweep option. I'm gonna put it here, whatever it is that I use to throw it. And see how much does this sweep can collect. And um, see, so ah, follow me and let's see how the sweep part works. You wanna follow me? So, I want you to take a look at the floor. This is what we like to see. It's real dirt. We didn't brought the dirt from our cell. Well, the dirt came from somewhere, but it's real dirt. It was left getting lost for um, five days or a week. We didn't touch this corner. So make sure it was dirty enough. So, let's see if the sweep of this device will give me an easier life. So the idea is no water, so let's um, put it in the corner. So far it looks like it's actually doing the job. Let's see on this one again. We go in the corner like this. I'm gonna try to go around. I'm not gonna take all the corners, but I wanna see at the end of the day how much dirt it collects. But let's see. I just want to make sure we get enough dust. It looks like it's grabbing a lot of the dust on the floor. Let me see in this corner. It doesn't gonna get all the corner because the, the, the thing doesn't go to the very edge of the sweep. But for some reason, it is lifting some of the dust. But the sweeper, if you see, is getting dusty. You see? That means it's lifting the, the, the dust that we have. Okay, so we dust it up. Now we're gonna check, I'm gonna try to throw in the box I have on the table to see how much dots pick from the floor, okay? So, follow me guys. So, the idea is, as you see this button here, this button should release the dust, right? And you see, it looks like you pick up some dust because it had dust in there. You see, this is dirty at the bottom, so that means it really touched some of the dust. So but the idea, this button will release whatever dust this came through. So let's see how much dust it came from that floor. This is how much. Um, and inside, we got some dust here. It was, you know, the dirt on the floor is mostly dusty, you see? So this is for like cleaning inside to get most of the dust, right? So that's how you use this, to clean it inside to get most of the dust. At the end, you're just gonna rinse it with water because this is hard, but my floor doesn't have that much dirt, like um, soil dirt, it's mostly dust in here. Um, most of the time I walk without the shoes, I think they're outside. So, 
We did that part. Now let's do the second part, which is what this thing promised. So what this thing promises is that you will connect this part. And this is the part I wanted to check the best. So you connect this part. This is your mop. So it's very tight. Just hold the bear through. So what I want to know is how much of that I can clean with this amount of water, right? With this amount of water without need to rinse this pad again. Let me put this on the floor to fix it a little better. I should have, I should have done it like this before. There you go, way better. Okay, now I'm gonna see how much this will clean without need to bring this pack before continue washing. Okay, that's the clear. So we noticed that the we noticed that the sweeper doesn't go to the corners because the the brushes you know ends like half an inch before of the sweeper, but this pad is going all the way down to the corner, you see? It can go to the corner. Here, the, bro the brushes is until here, so these two sides don't hit the corner, but this one goes So Yes, it's gonna be a little dustier on the sides, but the important thing is this is gonna do the job of cleaning. You collect most of the dust, and then you try to mop. So, this is the idea. This is what I like this, because I don't you spray. And then you mop. Look like it's cleaning, it's pushing the dust. Again, that part it has to be handled. I wanted to see something here only. Then I want to go to the corner. Let's see. I guess there will be some residual that at the end. Have to be collected, I guess. Let me go. Okay, maybe. Um, uh, well, it's not that complicated for me, it's easier, I just wanted to see, I guess I have to just push those issues forward. Let me take this because this is gonna make it run the carrier again. I'm gonna put the receiver forward. Let's see what the solution for it. So it cleans, so let's see the bottom. The bottom is still good to continue mopping, so let's mop another section of the floor. Moving this. So I'm gonna continue this section here I guess it's just pushing the oh, pushing the the dust away I'm gonna say so far it's just like mopping but pushing whatever dirt on the bottom is so so I guess I'm just gonna try to push it forward one way so, but it's cleaning Cleaning the floor, I don't have to go back to the bucket. 
I have to just push whatever dirt is picking up from the floor to one corner, right? And keep it there. For what I see the brush, the brush will be sweep first. Didn't do all the dust, mostly the one harder dust. That's what it took. The really one stick to the floor, that's the one you see it here on the floor. So I'm gonna give another another um, sweep. I like it so. And then after this, what I'm gonna do, right, is clean water. I always clean with the soap first and then clean water. So to make sure there's nothing left. I like this cleaning. Um pretty much like do the mop. When I clean with the mop pretty much doing the same so my my advice no up back and forth you know push lift push lift push lift push push right that's what I see is better because of the type of pad or mopping that this device has right once we push it once we push so the best thing I could say we could do for what I noticed, right? So instead of that, then step in and lift. Let's see. Oh, the brush again. Sweep again. Whatever is left. Oh, we get in. The room part is a little rusty, but it's cleaning, I guess. And then you put it back, and then you finalize it. The last part, and voila! Let me see. So far, it's clean. It's gonna see what I'm gonna do now. Then what you could do, you just put clean water and just swipe up it with clean water. That's what I do. That's what I would tell my mama. You clean well with your detergent and you do another swipe with clean water. My thing for me actually went perfect. Um, it's, I, this whole place is clean with less water than I would clean it with the other one. Because the thing is, when you clean it with the buckets and the mop, you reset and the water when you come back is dirty. This is always clean water all the time. It's not that dirt on the on the path. If you see, just the dirt here on the top. Um, the sweeper sweep enough to take most of the dust out of the floor. I think this is perfect. Um, the price of this, if I don't remember, it was one thousand. 1310 1310 for 1310 a month it's around 200 300 right maybe 500 um this is branded which is not bad because you know, but this is cool one part which you can rinse and clean it easily um it cleaned the floor pretty well it ruined the floor decently which is all you wish for and it didn't use too much um, water you could use more right I guess you could put more on the floor right and and do more wet right you could use more if you want and do it more wet right um, that's what it actually use less water less detergent clean pretty well for me it's a perfect device to clean in my house, I think this is gonna make my life way easier. I don't have to go back and forth, back and forth. Um, I recommend it. It's called Derma Derma Care. Derma, one second, guys. Derma, the Derma uh, Sweep and Mop. Um, you can find it online. That's what I found it in La Sala, actually. I think so. Ah, the name is here. Derma, actually, for those who wanna know. Derma, but is there are two versions, one is only the sweeper, the, the mop, and one has the brush and the mop. I would recommend the brush and the mop for 1310 And easy to assemble, very easy. I clean this and brush 
quicker than I do them with the regular way. That means my apartment is gonna look more amazing now, more cleaner every more days. I don't have to struggle too much. I hope you like it, guys. Um, remember, in days like this, we have to adapt and adjust, or we're just gonna struggle. I know we're all going through the same pandemic, and as always, I pray for you and your family, prosperity, health, and unity, and abundance of love. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I bless you and your family. Well, um, one more video for Jaggy D here at Jaggy D Knows, and I hope you like it. Please, if you haven't subscribed, do so, and put your notifications so you don't miss these opportunities of these random videos that we do every day. And on top of that, we will thank you because it helps us a lot. So I appreciate all your support and all your help. May God bless you always. And see you in the next one. Let it, let it, let it, let it, let it, let it, bang, bang.